This here is the all new YG620 by GoD, a brand new LED video projector that is priced at $269.99, creating a bargain of the price for an all new high definition projector. Now, this here shoots at 1080p, but can go ahead and support up to 4K as well. With the built-in surround sound stereo system, it creates an all-in-one exclusive package for video projection. Now, in this episode here, we'll be unboxing it, trying it out, and seeing what it's all about. So, if you guys wanted your very own, be sure to check out their link down below. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So this here is our LED projector, definitely a big box for what it is. So this here is um, an interesting looking setup. So this here is Goody. Uh, if you kind of rotate it here, it talks about a little bit more in terms of detail. So it has a resolution of 1920 by 1080. Uh, it works via an LED light, uh, aspect ratio of 16 by 9, and it's got a built-in speaker, which is kind of neat to see. And yeah, it looks like it's an all-in-one exclusive kit. So let's go ahead and take a closer look. All right, so this is kind of interesting. So you get this almost like a carrying case. I have not seen this before with the projector. And then you have this white box. So before you go into the carrying case, this white box here will contain our power adapter. And then it looks like our cable to connect it to the TV. Uh, we have ourselves a remote. So standard remote, so you have your controls, your volume. Uh, and then we have ourselves an HDMI cable, which is also included, which you don't see too often. So that is that. Now this here is a pretty cool looking case, so it's almost like a bag. Uh, so you can technically go ahead and take it out and about, which is always nice to see. And you have a double zipper. All right. We got ourselves our user manual. Uh, it's actually kind of giving us step-by-step -step directions on how to go ahead and set it up. Again, probably pretty straightforward for what it is. Now this here is our projector. Whoa, check this thing out. Uh, definitely a very nice looking projector. Um, on the back here, you do see a lot of what's going on here. So we have a variety of different inputs, which is nice to see. Uh, you have your aux, you have your headphones, you have a mini SD, uh, your power and your power port. And then looks like this might be like a tuning for uh, essentially kind of correcting it. And then you have yourselves your directional panel on the top here. So you have your manual controls. And then of course you have your lid pops off just like that. So uh, let's go ahead and plug in this bad boy and try it out. All right, so this here is our projector. I just plugged it in. Uh, you have your LED face on the front here. So the letters as well as all the control units are illuminated. Um, and then on the back here, you can actually see that the power button's right here. You have a variety of different inputs. Uh, and then you have your controller in terms of tilt sensors for the particular projector. Now, obviously the way it works, you just go ahead and remove the cap just like this. And we're gonna go ahead and hit power, and it'll go ahead and start slowly booting up. All right, so this here should be kind of fun. So I went ahead and set up my Nintendo Switch to the actual projector. So we're gonna go ahead and hit power. Uh, we'll start hearing that it starts warming up or turning on. Um, and then I have my Switch connected into one of the HDMI ports, and it's turning on. It's gonna go ahead and dim the lights just a little bit. Obviously, it needs to darken the room. There we go. And I think we're ready to go. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn on my switch. So you have this menu here that you can technically go ahead and switch over based on whatever you wanna use it. So you can use the movies, you have music, you have uh, photos, stuff of that nature. All right, whoa, look at that. That looks so cool. So you can see the quality on this is really good. <laughs> Man, this thing is so smooth. It literally looks like I'm watching on a high definition TV right now. <laughs> this is ridiculously awesome. So you can see the there's absolutely no lag at all in this. And you can technically make this as big as you want, as small as you want, based on however functionality you like it. Probably a really cool idea to do it outdoors as well. So yeah, I mean, I, I really like it a lot. Um, if you're looking for a nice projector that's actually really high quality, and at a good price, I mean, this you can't really beat this. I mean, obviously it's not a 4K projector, but then again, for the 1080p, this thing is actually really high def. The only thing that I might say is that so far, I feel like the controls are a little bit daunting. Uh, it does take some while to understand it, but other than that, it's actually not too complicated. Um, 
and again, you can see that the way I'm playing on the screen, it's actually really easy to control and really easy to use. The crispness of it is actually really nice. Uh, the edges are really sharp, which is really nice to see. And yeah, I mean, I think they did a great, phenomenal job with this. And yeah, sweet. <laughs> so kind of gives you an idea what this is about. Definitely a really cool looking projector. Um, I really like it a lot. I think they did a great job with it. It's really nice and high quality. I mean, even when I get close to it, I can see that there's a nice amount of detail. Um, almost looks like a 4K rendering. And yeah, there you guys have it. Now, if you guys have any questions about this awesome projector, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.